What is metastatic colorectal cancer? Colorectal cancer, also known as bowel cancer, is one of the most common cancers in the world. Colorectal cancer can occur in both men and women. Most cases occur in people over 50 years of age, but it can also affect younger people. If left untreated, colorectal cancer usually grows slowly starting in the colon or rectum and can eventually spread to other parts of the body, such as the abdomen lining, peritoneum, liver or lungs. When it spreads, this is called stage 4 or metastatic colorectal cancer. How does this disease develop? In the cells of your body, short sections of DNA, called genes, control how the cells behave and grow. Changes in some of your genes, known as mutations, can cause cells to grow and multiply too quickly. This uncontrolled growth can lead to tumor development and cancer. If this happens in your colon or rectum, it can cause colorectal cancer, which may then spread and become metastatic colorectal cancer. Some mutations are inherited and passed on from other family members. This happens in only 5 to 10% of colorectal cancer cases. If there is a family history, where several close relatives in a family have had colorectal cancer, other relatives may be at an increased risk of developing it. These family members may benefit from early cancer screening. Most colorectal cancers are sporadic or random, where the mutations are not inherited and happen by chance. These cases may be influenced by environmental or lifestyle factors, such as diet, smoking, and alcohol intake but random mutations can also just develop without a known cause. What genes might be involved in metastatic colorectal cancer? Random mutations in a gene called RAS or in another gene called BRAF are known to play an important role in the development of metastatic colorectal cancer. RAS mutations are found in over half of all metastatic colorectal cancer cases. BRAF mutations are found in 8 to 12% of cases. It is rare for anyone to have both a RAS and BRAF mutation. What does it mean if I have a RAS or a BRAF mutation? The RAS and BRAF genes control how cells function, grow, and multiply. Mutations in the RAS or BRAF genes disrupt these normal processes leading to uncontrolled cell growth and cancer. If you have a RAS or BRAF mutation, the cancer may grow more quickly, so your treatment may need to be adapted. How will I know if I have a mutation? Your doctor may take a sample of your tumour, also called a biopsy, during a colonoscopy. The tumor biopsy will be sent to a laboratory to find out whether you have any mutations. This is sometimes called biomarker testing. The results of your biomarker test are important to help you and your doctors choose the best treatment plan. How will my treatment be decided? There are a number of different treatments available. The treatments you receive will depend on whether you have any mutations, the type and location of the cancer, which treatments you have already tried, and whether they worked for you and your overall health. Chemotherapy is a standard treatment for cancer, often used to make the tumour smaller. Chemotherapy kills cells that multiply faster than other cells, including cancer cells and some healthy cells. You may be offered an immunotherapy. This works differently to chemotherapy by helping your immune system to identify and kill the cancer cells. You may be given a targeted therapy. This is designed to target the mutations within your cells that have led to cancer development. Unlike chemotherapy, targeted therapies act specifically on cancer cells that have these mutations. It is important to know if you have a mutation to determine whether a targeted treatment is right for you. During the course of your treatment plan, treatments may be combined or changed. It is important to know if you have a mutation to understand the cancer better 
and make sure you're getting the right treatment for you. Ask your healthcare team about biomarker testing.